uh, after my final race. In Kona 2011, I realised then that I'd achieved more than I could ever have thought possible um, and that I was really worthy of being a champion. Maybe I didn't realise it in all the years before. I think it took that race for me to realise. I find it difficult to, um, to relax and to sit still and to stay in the moment. I find it very, very hard to just be. And as an athlete, I was no different and I was constantly striving. So I'd have a fantastic race and I'd, of course I'd celebrate and I'd enjoy and I'd relish the victory. By the next day I'd be planning, planning the next onslaught. And that also meant that sometimes I made some really foolish errors about coming back to training too quickly after, after racing because I was just so desperate to then prepare for the, for the next event. And I'd, I don't know if I ever truly sat down and reflected on, on what a victory, what performance, good or bad, you know, men. Um, and it's only with hindsight now that I can really reflect on, on what I achieved and on some of those individual performances.